All right, back to the uh, <coughs> crankcase vent, the CCV. So what I'm doing is I'm routing it to the exhaust. Um, and I feel like it's the best way to do it because it, it, uh, it won't freeze for one. <coughs> and if you just vent it to the atmosphere, you'll have um, oil dripping out <coughs> wherever you have it vented to. So putting it in the exhaust, it'll burn it, burn all the excess oil and it won't freeze up. So what this is, basically it sits in the pipe at an angle like that and <clears throat> let's turn this around. So it angles in the pipe and then that there's a little ledge there, a little opening. That's supposed to create a vacuum through that um, port here. So we'll see how well it works. A lot of people actually I've seen run it the other way, like this way with the bevel towards the rear. And I feel like that would work better, but I can always, I'm gonna try it one way and then I'll flip it around, try it the other way, see what gives you more vacuum. Cause you don't want any restriction. You want, you want it to pull a vacuum to make sure you don't uh, blow any seals out. So I'm gonna put this in the downpipe Got it marked out there, so I'm gonna put it right about there, and then that hose is gonna run just right up to my little puck on the valve cover. So I'll pull that downpipe off, get a hole drilled in it, and we can get this thing welded on and see how it works once it's uh, once the truck's running. So I'm gonna get this installed now. All right, got the downpipe off, so that's about how it's gonna sit right about there. So let's get this thing drilled in and uh, get some welding on there. Sounds right. Alright, All right, we're gonna clean this thing up, so <clears throat> we're just gonna use acetone, wipe everything down, and then like every other stay in this project, <clears throat> we're going to uh, put some solar flux on the inside of the pipe so that it is uh, protected. So we'll mix this up. Alright, then we'll get some acetone, wipe all the Sharpie off, and just wipe the whole area. Wipe this as, too, this as well. Make sure that's all clean. Alright, there it is. It's all installed, so I just gotta run the line up and connect to here. Alright, here's the line finished up for that CCV. Uh, so I'm gonna throw that on the truck, show you guys what it looks like. Alright, there it is. So runs fr straight from the exhaust and basically just straight up right to that CCV. So I just got a barb adapter for here and then just a piece of hose. Um, so yeah, the biggest thing with these, the problems with these freezing is if you got a low spot in your line. So if, it'll, if you got like a loop or a low spot, <clears throat> the condensation eventually will build up there and freeze. 
and it will uh, plug that up and if you get that plugged up then you're blowing seals in your motor because <clears throat> your crankcase has nothing to vent to so that should never freeze even if there is condensation in there it's just gonna gravity is gonna bring it right down on the exhaust so that uh, definitely should work pretty good so yeah like I said I'm gonna pull this off before when I start the truck for the first time I'll pull this off and make sure that that uh, fitting I put in the downpipe is actually pulling a vacuum um, just to verify make sure everything's working like it should so